These are the bees. After a long hard journey, bees bring nectar from flowers to their hives. Then, with great effort, bees turn the nectar to beautiful, shiny honey. Bees hope that the honey will be nutritious and has high economic value. Unfortunately, geographic conditions do not support honey. Vietnam belongs to tropical regions, especially in rainy seasons, the honey moisture content is too high, ranging from 23.8% to 28%, which leads to honey spoilage. More importantly, the international standards for honey moisture content is about 18%. Therefore, honey needs to be dehydrated. However, the conventional method, which uses high temperature, is a complex process, requiring high operating and equipment costs and changing nutritional and sensory properties of honey. For all these reasons, Vietnamese honey is exported with low prices. In Vietnam 2020, 67,000 tons of honey were produced, and about 500 billion Vietnam was lost by using current dehydrating methods in an approximately 2,800 billion Vietnam honey market. Bees are depressed. What should we do? Welcome bees, we are Bee Innovative. We are five students from Ho Chi Minh City University of Technology, majoring in food technology and mechatronics engineering. We are doing the project called Novo Economical Honey Dehydrator. That is, a honey dehydrator can work at ambient temperature and its working principle is based on vacuum rotary evaporation and absorption. How does it work? First, the dehydrated zeolite is inputted into the equipment. Then, a vacuum condition is created. Next, the honey is pumped into the dehydrator. After that, the dehydration phase begins. At vacuum condition, the water is evaporated. At the same time, the equipment is rotated creating thin films of honey to accelerate the evaporation process. The evaporated water is then absorbed into zeolite. Finally, the dehydrated honey is harvested. The benefits of using this dehydrator are First, there is no heating. Therefore, when dehydrating the honey, the quality is improved. Unlike other heating methods, the quality is negatively affected. Second, because there is no heating, so the steam trap is eliminated. Therefore, the structure is more simple. The third one is that the operating cost is lowered, including lower vacuum pumping cost, because the vacuum pump is only used one time for the whole dehydration process. Zeolite can be recycled many times. Did you register for the patent? Yes, we did. We registered for the utility patent and got approved just after submitting 20 days, showing the great potential of this equipment. Could you show me the real-life operation procedure? Yes, of course.
by using this evaporator, the honey quality meets the international standards. And therefore, the export value is high, bees are now happy again. <laughs>